Item SCP-083 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-083 is to be kept under constant video surveillance, with at least one level 3 staff member on call at all times to respond to security breaches. Entrance to SCP-083 is permissible to level 1 and 2 personnel with proper clearances, provided they wear a tracking device while inside. Description. SCP-083 appears to be an uninhabited, two-story row house in a general state of disrepair, with an interior of approximately 366 square meters. It is located in the block of the deed and property tax records for the address are missing after. The last known persons to reside at the address were the family, but data expunged. Until acquisition by the foundation, the property was the reputed office for local narcotics dealers who gained entry to the structure through a front window. Since the locking mechanisms on both the front and back doors were corroded and frozen shut, SCP-083 first came to the Foundation's attention on when an altercation outside the building resulted in the front door being kicked in by data expunged. Those who entered through the door of SCP-083, Group A, allegedly found themselves inside a fully furnished and well-maintained home with functioning electricity and a fully Stocked kitchen whose appliances and decor appeared to be from the early 20th century. Personnel who entered through the windows. Group B. Described the interior as dark and dilapidated. Corresponding to the view through the windows. Personnel in Group A also reported that they couldn't see. Hear. Or find any members of Group B inside the house or of anyone else besides themselves. Group B observed that members of Group A seemed to vanish into thin air upon crossing the door's threshold. Both groups inside the property not only described very different living conditions, but their descriptions didn't even correspond to the same floor plan. Their descriptions matched only in the relative position of the windows, since both groups saw the same street view. Personnel outside the house, however, reported only seeing members of Group B. These observations were repeatedly tested and confirmed by staff, with the additional finding that the rear door of SCP-083 also leads to the furnished interior. Any non-conventional entry, that is, windows, holes in the roof, down the chimney, etc., leads to the dilapidated interior and persons inside the different interiors are unable to detect each other's presence. Although they both register on standard spectral imaging equipment, so long as said equipment is outside SCP-083, it was also discovered that the furnished interior is not static. The floor plan of SCP-083 apparently changes, with a different layout and different numbers and kinds of rooms manifesting. See document number 083A. No clear pattern or set interval has been observed in the rearrangement of the interior of SCP-083, but the phenomenon has never been directly observed or experienced by personnel while inside SCP-083. See summary of experiment 08303, listed as document number 083C. So long as a human presence exists inside, the floor plan seems to remain stable. Although the furnished interior appears to be well maintained, no inhabitants or custodians have ever been detected. 